Hi, this is RJ, and this subject is about review appraisals. Now, what is a review appraisal? Well, a re review appraisal is done when an underwriter feels like there is some information on the appraisal that has raised some question. Now, why I'm bringing up this topic is because I want to talk to you as a loan officer, as well as how to communicate to your customers about what happened to me this week. So, under the Guild guidelines, we have this preferred product. Now, understanding the preferred product, it is the best of the best interest rates and pricing for our premier qualified borrowers. Now, you have to remember, ideal borrowers have to match up with ideal properties. And in this case, two of my loans this past week ran into problems. One happened to be a single family dwelling and the other one happened to be a multi-unit dwelling. What made this difference was the underwriter ordered a review appraisal and based on the findings, my properties had unpermitted units. And a quick example, I had a three unit property that had a fourth unit built onto the property, did not affect the marketability or the saleability or the structural integrity of the property. It just had a fourth unit unpermitted. My other file had a single family home with a shed in the backyard, just a piece of slab, shed. It was converted to look and the appraiser noted and called it a studio. Didn't have a kitchen, didn't have a bathroom. It was a shed. Bottom line. The fact I'm trying to say is based on the review appraisals, it was brought to the underwriter's attention of both of these files. The properties had changed and do not qualify for the preferred loan program status. So here I had qualified buyers, but an unqualified property. What I'm trying to bring up is what happened as a result of these findings is now I have to redisclose to my client that the rate and the program that I selected for them is no longer qualified and they now have to go to a different pool of loans and that's the general FHA pricing loans and that is what happened to me this week. So if you can imagine the disclosure I had to say that yes the file was underwritten but then after the underwritten of the file there was a review appraisal which discovered some findings and based on those findings the property doesn't fit the program. I now have to quote a different program which obviously had higher rates and I had to redisclose a new good faith. So word of the wise, make sure you consult your clients and let them know of what a possibility that an underwriter may or may not order a review appraisal. And if they have any information regarding anything that would change the material condition of the property, if they know something about the property that you need to know, you need to ask both the agents as well as the buyer. Because in my case, I had two separate situations, completely different locations in San Diego, but this review appraisal revealed something that compromised the property that didn't qualify for the loan product. FYI.